it's not, it doesn't serve any function, but it's just it's just a cool factor. I mean, anything translucent is cool. You got the green controller, green translucent controller. The Today is Monday the 14th. Wait, let me check that. Monday the 13th for June. Okay, I'm ready. Welcome to Daily Vlog number 369. We get to make that joke. Okay, that's just how immature these photos are. Oh shit, it's bright. So it's currently 20 to 1. No, I didn't just wake up. I've been up for about two or three hours just watching random ass videos on YouTube. And I think in this clip I'm gonna make my bed. I do need to do that and play some more Xbox. Because I'm off work today. I will do some room cleaning at some point. Oops, that's obviously necessary. But right now we don't really need to worry about that. So yeah, thank God there's no fucking work today. Not that I would. No, I've got a problem with it, but do you know what? Since in fact, no, since I've came back, I've not actually had a day work because always around to absolutely fuck all. <laughs> so, as you probably could imagine, that makes me very happy. Now, this week's vlog is currently uploading. It's only like twenty minutes long, or something like that. And this one, I'll try and make it longer. So, yeah. Um, let's get the uh, bed made. It's, yeah, always. But I just realised something, right? With this being daily vlog number 369, we're only going to have 31 days till we hit 4 fucking 100 vlogs. 400, that's... To me, that's insane numbers. <sighs> Again, I will do these. I think at one o'clock I'll put the controller down and actually, you know, be a productive member of society. <laughs> mm. um, yeah, because I really do need to give my room a decent ish clean, which I'll be honest, I've not actually given it one since I came back. So, yeah, it would be kind of intelligent or fucking obvious thing to do. Um, yeah. I'm gonna go through the kitchen and quickly grab a thing or two. I also need to take a piss. Um, then we will play video games, so I'll be back in a moment. So I went to the toilet, went to the kitchen, uh, took my medication, and we went out some melon box, so that's cool. Um, no, the last couple of days I've got right back into gaming, and obviously I need to fix my PS4. See, look at the dust on this. But you can really see how bad that is. No, if I definitely wanted to say what kind of gamer I am, I'd say I'm more retro games than anything else for older game. One, most because of nostalgia, and two, some are just better. It's not bugged in, but actually, let me take a brush to that. I'm not even gonna let that sit like that. That's just no floor here. You can actually see all the dust flying on the camera. The PS2 is the same. I just, I always forget to do these. And you can see mine is the special edition of Star Wars Battle from 1 from 2015. So we're going to pull this out so that this one is connected, so not all the way. If 
Oh, I'm take it out give it off full clean later. Another thing gaming like that needs to be done is all those games I bought need to be organized and comfy. So yeah. I'm not sitting there with another right now. I'm gonna play some GTA five. I wonder how many people get nostalgic, include myself, for this controller. Mine is a bit worn out. So I'll see you guys at, I was going to say 1 but that's like 5 minutes, let's say half past 1, we'll put the controller down and stop playing. Right, so it's a bit later than intended, it is like quarter past 2, I'm still playing, see I was doing the high setup stuff but I didn't realise, or at least I forgot anyway, that if you do the final bit of high setup, which is get the knockout gas, it triggers the mission, so I'll do the heist mission, then I'll stop. Um, I'm just going back because I've still, I think I've still got some. Oh, brilliant, still got like one more packet left. I'll shove these in here, I'll, um, I'll show what I want. Good. Um, so it'll be the last thing I, mission I do today, so I just want a eh, quick update. Less in a minute. Anyway, I've a lot of fun, a lot of nostalgia with this game. Um, so yeah, and also we'll take a break, we'll do up my room, organise it, all that good stuff. And then later on we'll go back to the gaming. So I'll see you after this mission, which will be when I'm done playing. Alright, so in that update where I said, yeah, I'm going to do the jewel store heist and stuff, see, the problem is I didn't finish that, and then it's like, gives you another mission, and it's like, the one where you meet Trevor, and then, do you know what I mean, I kept playing and playing, and then I, basically I had to stop and watch Hollow Sister, so I paused the Xbox, and I only just saved it there, it is like 10 past 4 now, so... Mm, still doing better than I would in, you know, time length and yesterday's, so, I mean, we do have that going for us, so, I'm going to be commencing the cleanup within this update, so, 
certain bits will and won't be touched, if that makes sense. Well, no, I'm not going to make like that, but like, certain bits will be on camera. So it's like, maybe we'll do 10 minutes worth of updates or something, and then we stop and then get an update on the whole room. It's just sparkling. So, the worst parts, well, let's just be honest, completely all of it. We'll find something to put on the background. Then we'll get clean it. But yeah, it's been a long time coming. I mean, look at the dust and everything in here. It's just. The floor was clean when I came back in on Wednesday. Obviously, just like, you know, almost a week of just not hoovering it and just inhabiting the room. As you can see, clearly, wasn't the best. Part predictions that came true. Mm. Hmm. Ten hardest GT missions we all hated. So I'll tell you what, um, I'm gonna switch off that one in the background because I've been playing all GT lately. So in this clip. Hits 10 minutes or something, that's when I'll cut the camera and then you won't get any more updates, it'll just be clean. And I also promise to do the hoovering of the stairs, and even though like two dishes, I bet you I'm gonna get bitched if I'm not doing them. So, let's do this. So, the thing I'm gonna start with is over here because this could do some organization and junk. I'll be doing things like pull all these games out, leave these out, swatting through them all because. I'm going up the city centre again on Friday and I might trade a couple, even though I'm going to have like enough cash to buy the fucking half of the store. Um, doesn't help the trade while I don't play, because I'm potentially getting another Xbox or ordering one on Friday. When I sell this to my friend Ethan, I might sell him a few games I'm not playing as well. Or I might just throw those in for free because, well, friend discount. So, we're going to start by taking all this stuff off and going through it on the bed. So let's start. I've also just decided that since we're doing that, we might as well pull all this stuff up as well. So not just to organise the top of it, which I have my stuff here. It's, let's pull all this out as well. Right, apart from that penny, I think, in that box, which... So I keep all these things as like resealable bags when I'm storing certain Lego sets. Yeah. Basically, I'm not going to put all that back now, so I'm going to do the same deal with all this. I did move them video game stack to do over here so yeah I'm just going through the process and I'm like reorganizing things so it's like eventually I'll be off one big pile of things to deal with but you know what I think I'm okay with it that doesn't bother me in the slightest um so yeah I'm gonna move this um up here so it's a bit more yeah a bit more safe even though the many figures are upside down um yeah so Basically, I'm, gonna pull, I'm only pulling out the front bit of each, so it's like going with the video games and I'm leaving the book where they are. And I might do something with the concert, so I'll see what I've done this section here. So here's all the movies from the section of the movies. Now, I'm not going to bother with the stuff behind it, however, I'll just give it a quick skim over with a dust brush, you know. Screw it. That's no secret that I'm lazy. So I've got that much new video games, right, that I might shove all the DVDs and the mangas away in the closet and fucking take them out if and when I need them. That's definitely a concern for what I'm considering. Um, I've not went over which, like, the, well, I've went over the DVDs, but I don't intend to get rid of any of these, so, you know. Um, yeah. Oh, oh crap. So there, there, I'll see you once I've done Xbox. Right, done it with the Xbox games. Um, I've got all of these. Um, those games up there have not been integrated into it yet. But, I've got the mangas up there. I've already started this one. Again, we're not doing the stuff behind it. I'm just doing like a kind of face up. So basically, I think it looks like a B&M thing. <laughs> so, I'm just going to clear the PlayStation. And yeah, it's all PlayStation. One or two blu -rays. 
So the three that I'm working on have now been cleared again, booked, so I'll just need to help. So, as much as I'm going to sort through that later, I'm going to sort through the video game stuff first. Let's get those ones down. So one problem with this unit is you can't do this because well overlapping. So the best way to do it is like that. So I'm gonna do the video games first. I've dusted the cases down and stuff. The movies I've not figured out. So when we go through the video games and that one is obviously uh, sort of first rate, so we'll see you once that's done. And as I put games on the shelf, like I've already done these PS4 and Blu-rays, I'm going to remove all the CEX stickering because, well, I don't know what those are my cases. Now, doesn't that look a lot better? Let's continue. Oh yeah, they're looking good. So they're organised, so we've got Star Wars games, GTA games, then some of them run, they're all a bunch of driving games. And then just some random ass games in the back, so we'll get them wrong here. Again, there was no more room for those, but yeah. Uh, I guess got patched up, so even better. SOC 60, again, these are the Python new games I got. And the one original Xbox I game I got, but they work on a 360, so it's a win win. Um, just like going for these, so yeah, really organised. So we've got a big stack here of 28 360 games, which I've not been collecting these quite a lot in the last couple of weeks, so I'm going to go through them again, taking the labels off, because I don't see EX labels on my ship, so, yeah, um, there's no way in hell all these are fitting, but there's a couple of games I hope I'll be getting rid of when I sell this in the next month or so, so, yeah, and also I'm just watching for another 360, so, yeah, let's start going through them. Again, I'll point out that... Come on, versus having all these horrible stickers on them. This game case. This, this is what I'm going to miss when gaming 100% goes digital. Oh, mind you, I'm not on the current generation. I've not upgraded yet. It will be when GTA 6 comes out. That's when I'll buy a new console. But yeah, these will, I'm going to miss the physical game copies. So, here's an example of one we can't remove because, well, we just put them on, just put them on bloody good. So, Project Gotham Racing 4 is going to have to stay that way. That's how many games in we are. What we do is we might stand the Xbox up vertically, and, right? I might stand up vertically and then put games on the side opposite the fan, like on the side without the fan, so that's an idea. I'm going to get back to doing these. And rather annoying when I could get the bottom part of the case off, but not the top, so that's another one that's. Gosh, by the way, they're not going to stay in that order once I've went through and decided which ones I am, and I'm not going to keep out. Um, I'll organise them like the way I did those ones, so i going to keep going. I might be wrong, but I'm fairly confident none of these games I've got, other than that Halo, I've got tags on them. I'm pretty sure that all these games have not got any on them, so just in case I go through these games, it's quite past hit 10 minutes, but I will finish off the video game section. I'm not going to randomly cut it. That's one of the games and I actually are accepting like two of them. There's Central, the third there, then there, it's there. I'll get rid of that one and get rid of the console, so... See, like, was like two minutes, that's how long it takes. So, last a minute later, so I guess to shove them all in, see how many doesn't don't fit. So, again, not including that one, and who knows, I'm like another couple that I don't add to the pot. The, the ones that these are just some of the games that haven't fit, and there's my second copy. So, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna organize them by what they're from, but first, let's put the Xbox the other way. I did take the disc out. And put it back in since I'm gonna play GTA 5 later. Right, so um, I'm not gonna go and organize these games by you know what genres and stuff. So things like GTA's are gonna be up top here, all with like the Lego games, and then things because those are games I play most frequently and everything else. I'll be along here somehow. So let's see when it's all done. Do you know what? This bit's not been sorted, but this bit has, and this is kind of idea. So. This doesn't completely fill this bit up, if that makes sense, you know, I mean, I've got a bit of movement, but I'm going to go through and organise them, as it also means I've got a little bit of room to expand, because, you know, I plan to continue to collect from my Xbox 360, so let's sort these out. Okay, so other than that one game, they've been sorted in the categories, like, you know how I've got my Lego games and then my GTAs, well, I'm doing something similar here, 
This is called Call of Duty. The Halo Wars. These games are a bit random. This is all the Forzas, the Saints Rose. So let's get it all up in this unit. And so just like this section, this has been sorted to So from here all the way up. So from here to here we have all the Call of Duty. Or they're trying to make them in order. From here all the way up to here we have Halo. From here to here we have Saints Row. And from here to here, these two games here, is the Forza Motorsport. From here, from here to here is kind of like just random. We've got like Transformers, Star Wars, Call of Duty, Rose, and Project Gotham Racing 4. I put that in there so that, because if you take that out, that annoys me slightly. But, you know, that's just in there for the prevention of that. Anyway, conveniently, my phone is down to 16%, so I'll always flash in a moment. That game's going away in the closet. I've got that from for my evening still, so. Yeah, um, I'm gonna go. I'll see you guys once the entire room, everything's been done. It's currently quarter past five, so see you in another couple of hours. So it's quite a bit later, and it's not that long until half past, it's like five minutes. So all oh, this is looking great and clean. Oh, it's like laced around for a while, I've been sorting through all this and. Had my dinner and I flew up the stairs and didn't fucking swing that, but yeah. So I'm gonna just go for the progress. I'm gonna fix it because I'd say about the property and sports right now. Just putting things back. This is still going here, that plug thing. Go back on the floor. I stay in there until I find a little place for it. And I want finally these are the mini for like, you guess what? They'll turn fucking rarer ones. These are. Quite rare ones I've got to begin with. Let's see, they go instructions. There's a set somewhere here as well. Let's see, we've got those ones. We've got the tank. No. Those are public fire tanks. Um, yeah, there we are. These can come along here. Get them down. So I've had a message from my friend David who has appeared in vlogs previously. Um, that's going to forget that he's calling it. I'll be here tomorrow. So, yeah. I think I'll go with him. Um, I don't mind waking up early. I'm also I'm working tomorrow and I rarely do things before work, but do you know what? I'm it's David, so I'll give up the time again. Let's see. Um just figuring all this out. This box here. Go open this up. Oh, they're sitting around the usual. I'm sure all the junk into this box and then just chuck it out. Honestly, well, today has went fast. See, once I've done all this, I've done the dishes. Sit down for a few hours and just continue playing for the GTA 5 campaign. Why am I putting that in there? That's getting fucking thrown out. Main just shows all the shit that's here. Oh, sorry. No, apart from these notebooks, I don't know why the hell I put those down there. This vlog has primarily been tidying. Hmm. Um, let's see. I'm gonna go through these again. I don't know why. Bye! Put that in 
bir şey olur. Ulan şimdi hemen enerji kopyayım dedin. Bu renk yine on ulan direği. Hocam. It's quite sad but. Might continue. Don't know how she's on about. Some of this I'll just swallow. Like I'm going to put it in the general direction where it's going. I guarantee you when I go through those dishes, they will be so fucking messy and disorganized. Like, very badly. Well, it goes there. This bit picked up and goes there. This coat hanger will be the last thing we'll organize. Yeah, I'm joking, it goes in here. Right, so I'm going to move my dishes and probably see you right when I come back. Um, I don't know. Be, when I come back, I'll be... I'm going to finish this and place it with the tea. Hmm, someone must have bought from Tesco's. Anyway, it's half past nine. Room still a mess, so tomorrow I'll meet up with David. And we're going to hang out the entire day of the day. I got off the phone from a while ago. I can easily put this stuff away quite quickly. Um, I'll do that later. I'll try to put them. I want to play some video games. We'll quickly take this stuff up well at once. It'll be somewhat productive. Um, let's see the moon goes in there. One sec, it's in it. Just from here. Tell you though, I wasn't joking when I said I tried my hardest to make this a longer vlog. No, I definitely think I succeeded at that. How many tickets me and David have got in that arcade are crazy. So most of the stuff is just going to get shoved here anyway. Let's just be honest with ourselves. <laughs> What's left is sweet. Again, do I want? I didn't hoover, oh, which probably annoys me quite a bit, but I think we've not done too bad with the whole coin up thing. Stuff definitely looking a bit neater. Put our books cute there for now. I don't have any snacks in that square, but I've got plenty. And I'm not joking, I mean plenty. You just lie around like full bottles, right? I can tell you, I'm be comfortable so I can play the game. It's all this paperwork junk. I need to find a bag to put it all in. Screw it up. This is a C, but it's the X bag. I don't plan on buying anything from them. I can always, they'll they give you bags for free. So we just bundle all this in the bag and then we'll get playing. That's so to pick up over there. Right. Oh, that music's not copyrighted. So I'm going to sit and play till probably about 11 o'clock or something. It's, again, got an hour and a half. You know, my most recent thing was unlocking Trevor and stuff and doing some of the Trevor related missions, so. Do you know Screw it, I'll get footage of me driving to, to Trevor's place. You know, I'm actually trying hard here, it's a wee bit oh, difficult. 
try to drive this with one hand. I like this car I stole last time I played. The reason I still have it is I'm using the uh, quick save. Again, try to drive this one, hands awkward. Anyway, why don't I see you guys at 11 o'clock? Alexa, set an alarm for 6.30 a.m. Alarm set for 6.30 a.m. Alexa, remind me to get up to meet David at 6.30 a.m. Okay, I'll create a reminder at 6.30 a.m. So it's actually half past 12. <laughs> the gaming session went on for fucking hours. I was like, I'll stop by it fucking went on an extra hour and a half. <laughs> As you know. I need to be up in six hours, so we are gonna be going and getting some sleep. Right, I'll be back in one minute then, just let me go take a fish. Alright, let's uh, put something on the TV and so we can go to sleep. But yeah, apparently. So tomorrow going up the to town is going to be a big pain in the ass. At least kind of because I'm skin. <laughs> I've got £51 in the bank plus bits of change. But that change is going to be a bust for you. So, yeah. Hmm. Yes. Gone on us in the air, someone break. <laughs> Mm. Sorry for the lack of talking, but I am looking for some stuff.
<sighs> yeah, I'm gonna watch that time again, credit with the camera compilation, so I'll see you guys in the morning and yeah. I'm gonna meet with David, we're at F8, I'm gonna go to the calls interview, we're gonna hang out at the time. Sounds like a fucking plan.